This is a wonderful hotel, I know. It's where a lot of, you know, high class hookers work. Well, it's a nice perfect. hotel. You don't come near You got to fly like an eagle Roar like a lion in Africa Leap like a salmon home from the sea To keep up with me I've got to walk like a panther tonight Walk like a panther tonight <laughs> Oh, ladies and gentlemen, you're beautiful, you know, you make me feel like a star. I think Kiki might have gone further if she uh, had a little more voice training. She should drink less and, you know, get her voice a little less raspy. Jesus loves me and it's I know The Bible tells me so Little ones, little ones to him belong They are weak, they are weak But he is strong, yes, Jesus loves me, Jesus loves me yeah. How do I know? Because the Bible, John the Bible 16. The first time I saw Kiki play, it was it was it was pretty awful. Um, she lasted about 20 minutes. There are so few technically perfect perfect singers, but you know, she, it, it's all soul. I first met Kiki and Herb in the swinging 60s when I was heading up the band Mellow Candle. We met Kiki and Herb. Everything's very, very, very foggy. I think it was in the 50s when they were recording Hazy Days. I have a terrible sense of chronology, but it was sometime in the 90s or maybe the 70s that I first ran into Kiki and Herb. Maybe it was the 50s. They were hazy before other people were hazy. Really? Like a full a few... They years. were hazy before we were. I was really scared of Kiki and Herb. They're, they're terrifying. And, you know, you would try to leave the room, but you couldn't because they basically bolted the doors shut and electrified them. They redefined captive audience, really. They were basically the most defunct, frightening vision that I've ever seen in my life. And I look at my hips. You look great, And I got dressed so I could just <laughs> sleep, so they could just come in and interview me when I woke up. Plus that, I was on a lot of acid at the time. It was like the worst trip I ever had. Hi. Yeah, yeah. You didn't yeah. tell me they were in the room. They're in the room. Sorry. Hi. Somehow it was so awful that I that I fell in love with them at the same time. It's you and me. It's you and me. We won't be unhappy. No, no, no. I can't really retire. I don't see, yeah, I don't 
see that happening. Well, we just have to keep working, John. We don't have a pension, so we have to keep working, ladies and gentlemen. We never yeah. quit, you see. If I had my way, we live in Sunny Village somewhere. I, you That'd know, nice. my sister Candy, she lives down there in West Palm. How did we get this room? Uh, I remember checking in. Pete and Herb are very like, they just sort of shoot in and shoot out. Like, you know, they sort of, you just don't know when they're coming. They just they're, drop in and they- They're very friendly, but they're hard to be friends with. I don't want to work, but they want me to sing, but they want me to be nice to people. I don't think I have, I can be nice to people all the time anymore. I'm too old. That's what you have to retire from. You retire from having to be nice to people. Well, they come to stay and they don't not, go, not or then they just, suddenly disappear. They're yeah. not very organized. Yeah. There you go. What do you need? This push the cushion keeps sinking. I need a bigger pillow. You got them all. Puff me up, Herb. Puff me up. And we go. Okay. Oh.